We all know him as the man behind the largest financial fraud in U.S. history. And tonight, we're getting a snapshot inside Bernie Madoff's former world, where he and his wife spent their days and nights while he was spending other people's money. In tonight's Living Large, Emily Smith takes us inside his Upper East Side penthouse apartment, the one that Madoff once called home. On East 64th Street at Lexington Avenue sits a 4,000 square foot duplex penthouse. Bernie Madoff lived here from 1984 until 2009, until sold in 2010 to the marketer behind Pokemon and Cabbage Patch Kids, Al Khan. The seven room duplex has 11 foot ceilings and lots of detail. Douglas Elliman's Michael Graves showed us inside. As you walk off the elevator here, you land in this beautiful, elegant entry foyer with coffered ceiling, crown moldings. And Palladian windows overlooking Manhattan's Upper East Side. They're original from 1927. Other classic detail includes the herringbone floors. And this is a perfect place to entertain your guests because if you open up your double doors, um, you can have perfect flow throughout the penthouse. terrace runs the perimeter. From the dining room, you can also access the terrace, and it has one of several wood-burning fireplaces. The kitchen has a solarium breakfast nook and lots of stainless steel, including an indoor grill. This is the perfect way to cook a steak inside, and this vents out to the roof. A spiral staircase brings you to the lower level with an east-facing master suite. The suite includes a mahogany library with built-in bookshelves, it also has a silver leaf ceiling. It's not paint. No, it's not paint. It's actual real silver leaf ceiling. And it's very, very beautiful. And it's done, uh, I think, very tastefully. To live large here, it will cost you $15 million. That's living large on the Upper East Side. Right, moments ago, we spoke to the broker at this apartment. He told us there is an interested buyer, but a final deal has not yet been worked out. So there's time for you to Got some put time. your bid in. Right. No, it's not done till it's signed, right? Ain't over till it's over. <laughs>